Hello Aries, it is the Sun Sage taking a look at your love connection update um, to see what the current energies are for you and your love connection. Um, for some of you, this may resonate as just a love life update to see what's going on if you're not in a connection. Also, if you um, are in need of a personal reading, make sure you check out the details in the description box for something more specific for your situation. All right, so what do we have for Aries placements? Okay, that didn't go well. All right, let's try that again. Aries, your love connection update. Let's see what the current energies are when it comes to your love life. All right, what do we have for Aries? What's going on right now? Okay, the emperor coming out the gate with your energy. Six of cups. Four of Swords in the reverse. Two of Cups. Okay. So, Ten of Wands. You or your person, definitely ready to come out of the doghouse or out of the cold. Five of Pentacles in the reverse here is actually a really good sign. Um, someone is tired of like feeling sorry for themselves or uh, in a space where they're ready to heal things instead of avoiding them. Someone does look like they're taking some accountability here for some of their wrongs, for some of the things that they have done here. So it looks like you guys are um, about to have a reconciliation or you are about to, things are about to go back to the way they used to be between you and your person when things were better is what I'm getting. Okay. Um, I feel like your person person was checked out for a while. They didn't feel like the same person and they're waking up and they're seeing that they want a stronger, a better relationship with you. So again, starting with uh, taking some sort of control of the direction of this connection is what it looks like. Your person is probably going to be a lot more um, gentle with you, a lot more sentimental. It looks as if you're getting the energy of someone who feels like you have been maybe somewhat defensive against them. Um, um, and and they want to get get you to soften up or get you to soften up again. Okay, you have Aries energy very strongly here, Scorpio as well. Let's see what the Emperor is. Someone is thinking about you heavily, and that's causing them to take action. The Four of Swords being here in the reverse with the Two of Cups is feeling a lot like someone finally waking up and realizing they want to be with you. What is the Emperor? It's the chariot. So uh, you you actually could be expecting a visitor or you're expecting this person to take action towards you or come towards you. I also feel for a lot of you, this person was definitely going through something. The five of pentacles in the reverse can also be a sign that what something like recently your relationship has maybe been going through some challenges or suffering because of financial issues. And someone may no longer be having those financial issues with that five of pentacles being in the reverse. They may even come show up in a new car. There may be an Aries here who is getting a new car from this person, or this person is uh, wanting to travel with you or towards you. So there's just really strong energies of movement where there's possibly been some stillness in your connection, okay? So I feel like this uh, this Aries, this emperor energy um, or Aries energy, you could be an Aries dealing with an Aries, but this person feels like they're ready to take control of the reins again in this connection. They may have been trying to leave stuff up to you and just, it kind of made you feel like you were waiting around for them. Um, they're about to, to, to return to the, the, them that you fell in love with is what I'm getting with the six of cups. What do we have this for? Um, some of you are getting flowers. You may have already gotten flowers from this person. The seven of wands. Okay. So the flowers were their way of apologizing or they will be, um, but um, flowers aside, there's some sort of uh, symbolic gesture coming in from this person, letting you know, I don't want to lose you. I don't want to mess up the love that we have or had for one another. So there's some sort of investment being made here. I have the two of pentacles here at the bottom. Um, your person is coming back around is what it looks like. This cycle isn't over between you and them. The four of swords in the reverse. They're really restless about connecting to you. They, they're probably dreaming about you 
They can't sleep. They're daydreaming about you. They want a resolution for sure. Five of Wands. You, you, you feel like you're dealing with somebody who's kind of like my way or the highway. And now they're starting to ease up because they feel maybe you're not going for that. <laughs> so, um, this person is ready to fight for you in a good way with this four of swords in the reverse. Um, that, that waking up energy, becoming more alert, becoming more aware of, of the conflict between you, the issues between you. What is this five of wands about? What was happening? What's happening? Queen of Swords. I feel like this person may have been following some some advice from someone, not necessarily bad advice, but it's just not the advice for y'all's connection. You could have a person who's been listening to a feminine energy who's very opinionated and possibly very critical of this connection. Um, maybe they, you know, had issues with you guys being together to begin with. And so um, I feel like this four swords in the reverse is feeling a lot like your person may no longer be under someone's mind control. If you feel like your person has been difficult lately, I do feel like it's because there was another energy here. For some of you where there wasn't someone else involved, but that strongly looks like it, especially with the five of wands representing some sort of clashing of uh, direction or purpose right you wanted something different from what they wanted or you were realizing that they were uh, going a different direction than y'all discussed and that could be because someone was very influential i also feel like this is just saying that this person wants to fight uh, smart. They they feel like uh, fighting for this connection in a in a smart way is much better than just like arguing and clashing with you all the time. It looks as if somebody's coming to their senses. I will say they've gotten some clarity. There was a, a recent argument you may have had. Some of you, it could have been four weeks ago. Some of you a few days ago, maybe five days ago, this person was being um, kind of weird. It looks as if they've um, they've entered um, clarity. They're, they're, they're experiencing clarity now and they know that it's you they want to be with with the two of cups. Why do we have that here? You guys have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here. It's a two of cups. Yeah, the king of cups. Your person is about to be a lot more tender, affectionate, and understanding of your feelings, okay? I do get the energy of you or your person kind of being defensive with the other. Maybe you were both this way with one another and it was making it difficult to like penetrate, um, to get to like some, some love and some softness between you. There's a relationship that's getting a lot more understanding, though, for sure. Someone is understanding what you mean to them. Um, you could definitely be understanding more what this person means to you, Scorpio, here. All right, so the Ten of Wands. This is someone ready to take on the responsibility of a relationship, right? They were possibly trying to avoid responsibility. Now they're ready to take on responsibility here. The world, yep. They don't want this to all have been for nothing. They don't want to fail. They're coming back. Your person is coming back. And this feels more than about somebody who left and they're returning. This feels a lot like you guys maybe were together and they just were like being a little different from what you were used to. They weren't um, the easiest to talk to. They weren't the easiest to connect to. The old version of them is returning. And in this case, that looks like a good thing. The Six of Cups, you're getting Emperor Energy, King of Cups, somebody who um, has strong willpower. And, uh, so if any stress or tension was happening in your connection, it was about a challenge or a cycle um, where you guys needed to go through this to see if you were supposed to be together. That that hardship is ending, though. What's the world? The hard the hard part is over. Death. It's over. The hard part is over. Um, I strongly get that your person is willing to be a lot more understanding. They're willing to return, okay, with something to offer or more to offer than before. But this five of pentacles in the reverse. Um, I feel like you guys really made this person um, um, stick by your standards here. Maybe they thought 
okay, maybe I can kind of play around with Aries, right? They, they're they not going to leave or they're not going to, you know, they're not going to take their energy away from me. I think they got a big lesson, which is why you're going to see such a huge turnaround with this person. So your relationship with them is about to transform. I feel like that's a good thing for most of you, but there is a new cycle um, of this connection that you're entering where it feels like you and this person passed the past cycle together successfully. Okay. So Aries, that is what I have for you. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe. Let me know what you think. If you are interested in exclusive content, make sure you're checking out the Sun Sage on Patreon. Link in the in the description box. And if you are interested in booking a personal reading with me, check out the sunsage.com. Link in the description box.